Oh, uh, wrong screen. Oops, one second. Oh, it's gonna be that day, I guess, chat. Oh, it's gonna be that kind of day. Okay. <laughs> you saw nothing. You saw nothing. Hi. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> We're not to the game screen yet. One second, chat. Uh, hello, new day. Congrats on first today. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a, uh, great day. Welcome in, Jake. You were so close. Maybe next time. Uh, let's see, let's see. Welcome in, Kate. Hello, hello. Good to see you. I feel like it's been a while. Hope you're doing well. Oh, thank you for the bofa. Thank you, thank you. Sip, sip, sip. <laughs> uh, let's see. Welcome in, Hug. Uh, welcome in, T-San. Bolt, welcome in. And again, uh, thank you so much for the follow while I was offline. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Hope you're having a great day. Do, 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 do. Welcome in so Welcome in abstract. Welcome in Zaporo. Uh, welcome in Eddie. Oh! Eddie, thank you so much for the resub. Thank, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh, welcome in Thwipshot as well. Hello, hello. I think I got everyone. Hello, hello. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. Um. I feel a little scatterbrained today. I don't know if you can tell Chan. Uh, but I'm doing pretty okay. It's been a been a good day. Oh my goodness. Hug. Hug with the 75 stream watch. That's insane. I wish... I wish Twitch would give us some sort of thing, like alert option or something for these watch streaks. Because, oh my goodness, I I want something to happen when they get to certain numbers. That that would be really neat. That would be really neat. Twitch is missing out on an opportunity here. What if... What if I want... Uh, an awkward chuckle to happen whenever someone gets 69 watch streak? What if I want the entire, like, Zelda Symphony, uh collection to play whenever someone reaches 300 like they're missing out they're missing out on an opportunity here i feel like it wouldn't be that hard they need they need they need to they need to add in some more uh functionality to stream streaks you know get the work twitch dubs exactly come on what did you think? You were just gonna let people come in here and, and drop these silly numbers and not let us streamers be like, Hey, look at this person. Look, here's an alert. It's it's gonna do this funny thing whenever someone reaches this specific number. I want something that happened when Streak hits a certain number. First number, she was 69. Listen, it was the closest number I could think of to 75, okay? <laughs> and everyone, everyone is always like, hee hee, funny number, 69. The next one I was gonna say is 420, but that one felt a little high. Ah! <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, pun not intended, pun not intended, I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Also, Nuka, welcome in, welcome in, good to see you! Ali, da, 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 da. Griffin, I got some new soap, shampoo, and conditioner. Today. It smelled pretty great. Oh my goodness! That's amazing. I hope you enjoy it. Smadge? Yeah, smadge indeed. Let's see, let's see. Ba, 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 ba. Catching up, catching up. Twitch isn't gonna do anything that fast there. I'm a lot. Amazon Overlords? True, true. We just need to throw more uh, money at Amazon Prime and then maybe one day. Maybe in like a year and a half, like two months before they, um, oh god, what's the word? Uh, two months before they delist or, you know, um, deplete, no, it's a D word. Uh, uh, trash, watch streaks. They'll be like, okay guys, we added the functionality to add alerts to, uh, watch streaks. And then two months later, okay guys, I'm sorry, we're getting ready to watch streaks. You know, because that, that's how it always feels like it goes. Like, they made hosting better, and then they took it away, and then... They were actively working on, like, the uh, Watch Together stuff, and then I, I think they, like, took it away, or they did something with it. So they just... They're silly. They're silly. 
Welcome to Yamamoto! Good to see you, good to see you! Hope you're having a great day. I'm angry, I had a sleep craving, so I decided to bake soft dry pastry and- You forgot sugar! Oh no! Oh no! How could this happen to you? You made your mistakes! Uh, you forgot the sugar! Uh, I don't know the rest of the song. <laughs> I don't know how it goes. I'm so sorry, that sounds awful! May our, may our, uh, baked goods always have sugar in them, forever, and ever, and ever, and ever. That sounds awful, that sounds like an abomination. Uh, put powdered sugar over it. I, I don't know how... I don't know what happens if you don't put the sugar in, like, does it still bake the same? It's just not really sweet? Like, is, is it just not really sweet? Is it just... Does it like change everything? Does not having sugar in there change like the entire consistency of whatever you are making? So I would say you could put like a ba 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 ba. Kind of works with some sweetness. Yeah, you could maybe put mm, uh what is it? Confectionery uh, powdered sugar in in it on on it on it yes on it not in it on it like sprinkle it you know like how sometimes they do with like pancakes or crepes or something. Maybe you could do that, and th that'd be how- I mean... I know the, uh, powdered or slash confectionery, whatever you want to call it, sugar, doesn't quite taste the same as normal sugar, but maybe it'll save it? Because, I don't know about you, but... Even... Even if I mess something up, I hate throwing it away. It's still edible. I mean, it's- it, it doesn't taste bad. It doesn't taste what you were, like, wanting it to taste like, but... but I don't know, maybe, maybe you can salvage it? I don't know. I don't know. But I know whenever I mess things up, I feel awful about like throwing it away. Food waste triggers my anxiety? Yeah, I... I... I hate throwing food away so much. Well, Lindsay Fangs, good to see you. Let me catch up chat again. I'm the proud owner of 300,000 snacks. Oh my goodness, that's so many snacks. Where do you keep them all? I would have had 90, but Twitch has a brain fart and killed it. I'm sorry, though. I know. I know. I'm sorry to hear that. You spend 30k and transform her over and over again? Uh, very true. Very true. However, uh, I believe the transformation is also on a cooldown, so you can't, uh, do it, like, immediately. Though, I think my cooldown only lasts for as long as the transformation lasts, so I don't know. I, I haven't touched that in a little while. Kind of works, but there's no sweetness, like tea without sugar. I sprinkled some confectionery sugar, so it made it taste like normal bread. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, I spent the last few years learning how to cook, and baking still so wild to me. Uh, baking, I would say baking and cooking, yeah, they both happen in the kitchen, and you both, you use, like, kind of the same stuff for both of them, but I would say that they're completely different. Cooking is more like, uh, I'm just gonna throw a little bit of this, a little bit of that, and, you know, like, a a good handful of this other thing in there and it's gonna it's gonna come out great and you're able to adjust as you're working but baking is i would feel a more exact science cooking is like oh yeah bada bing bada boom uh uh just throwing whatever's in there and you know it works whereas baking you put like a fourth or even an eighth of a cup too much flour in something and it just messes up the entire thing. It's just, it, oh my gosh, I have I have been the victim of that. I put in a little bit too much flour and I did not have cookies, I had biscuits. I had biscuits, I had, I had things that were denser than I was. Like, oh my gosh, I had like soup crackers. It was insane. Uh, you, <laughs> You guys should ask Kudo about my my wonderful uh, dense cookies that I've been known to make. Uh, I haven't I haven't done it in a in a little while. I've been getting better at it, but oh man, I remember <laughs> there was one batch that he said that we could use as bricks. They were just so dense. They <laughs> that the rain wouldn't even. Uh, wouldn't even soak into them, they'd be perfect. <laughs> like, they were, like, old-style food rations. They were just hilarious, because they really were! <laughs> they were, like, so dense, chat. I- I can't... 
I, I can't stress how dense they were, Jeff. It was hilariously awful. It was hilariously awful. Let's see... I don't follow this person get a gifted sub to them? What? Uh, let's see, uh... Do, 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 let me catch up. Uh, I believe I said hello, but welcome to Zifeng, so we're having a good day. Ooh, Questle. And my stream streak can only last till the end of August, so I'll enjoy it as long as... I Why? Why August? Why August? Do you... Are you going on, like, a trip or something? Hello, Sir Mars! Welcome and welcome and good to see you! You can make cookies when it comes to baking, that's really about it. Oh my goodness, I still have yet to get the right consistency for cookies that I want. They're not... They're not like that that batch I was just telling you about, where they could probably survive in the basement for like ore rations for months, years even. But they're they're uh, also not like gooey and like you know the the melt. Like, the, the kind of drooling cookies that, that, oh my goodness, like, that you dream of with chocolate chip cookies and stuff like that. Welcome in, bro. Good to see you. Baking Charlie is scientific. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta have exact measurements. Gotta be as, as exact as you can be, or it, um, doesn't work out as you intend it to be. Even just, even just, oh, I'm just gonna add just, 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 just a touch more. No, 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 no. We don't do that in baking. We don't do that in baking. Just, just a, just a little touch. Can throw off the entire recipe. The entire recipe. It's crazy. It's so crazy. Dense cookies works amazing. Coffee. I don't even think coffee would have fixed, would have fixed those cookies. <laughs> Soup crackers, not bricks. That's biscotti. No, I've never, I've never seen a pastry that that was as dense as the ones that I made. It was hilarious. It's awful. <laughs> so awful, chat. I wish, I wish there was something that I could compare it to, cause like they were, <laughs> they were still pretty, uh, they were still pretty soft and stuff. They were very dense. I would say it's like. Hmm. I don't. E I don't even know what 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 I can compare it to. <laughs> Hudo, yeah, poor Hudo. He's he's usually the uh, uh what a besides me the other taste tester for the things I make. <laughs> spicy cookies. Well, okay, I've never made spicy cookies before. That that's that's at least at least I've never accidentally made spicy cookies. I feel like spicy cookies could be good depending on, like, the recipe, though. I feel like it could be- it could be a good thing. I saw the summer citrus scent while I was running some errands and Targon got some during the Memorial Day sale and smells pretty good. Ooh, that does sound pretty good. I'm a big fan of citrus scents. I- I remember in school, uh, the girls always used to wear, like, citrusy scents and I was like, mm, come over here and let me- let me sniff you. You- you smell really good. It was just, oh my goodness. I could never get enough of, like, the the perfumes that the were all citrusy and stuff. But I've been, I've also been really into, like, the vanilla uh, scents. I was about to say flavors. Uh, I mean, flavors too, but also scents. Vanilla scents are also nice. Cookies hello, Orby! Welcome and welcome in! Good to see you! Hope you're having a great day. I always get gifted subs from people I don't follow. It's your raids, bunny raids, other people. I watch raids, others. Oh, I see, I see. I feel like that's a... a thing that you can turn on and off in the Twitch settings. I'm like 95% sure there's a setting in there. If you go around looking or maybe Google it, that says uh, that you're not... that you can turn off being gifted subs to channels that you do not follow. This is so thank you so much for the hydra. I'm catching up chat. I just adopted the hack of dousing oh dousing your cinnamon rolls in heavy cream butter and brown sugars before the oven. Oh really? I've never heard of that before. It sounds really good though. Did you melt the butter instead of whisking it? I did that the first time I tried making cookies. Oh wait, uh did you melt the butter instead of whisking? I feel like I always melt the butter instead of whisking it like accidentally, not purposefully. I always just because it says like uh, soften the butter, but it, it, it doesn't say melt the butter, but it says like kind of softened Not like fresh out of the fridge like still kind of hard So I put it in the microwave usually to try to soften it and then I Melt it. It happens like every time every time Every single time 
thin but soft she baked lead cookies i would compare it to somewhere between like uh egg crate foam and styrofoam kind of dense it was something i i think that's the best i can describe that those that dense uh thing of cookies i made it was oh my goodness I once bought spicy chew- Oh, spicy chewing gum! From vending machine, they're pretty good. Okay, so one of my... One of my... F I used to have- I used to have gum all the time in middle school. Like, all the time! I always had a pack of gum. I don't know why, but it was very popular to have a pack of gum in uh, middle school. And I'd always ask my grandma, could I have some gum? And... I got really into the five gum, especially the cinnamon, the spicy cinnamon flavor. I don't know its exact name. I think it was red and it was like a spicy cinnamon because I always used to have like sinus issues. I used to be really stuffy. I used to be really, uh, I used to have really bad allergies all the time. So I was always stuffy. I couldn't really like, uh, I was always stuffy. I was always stuffy. And the spicy cinnamon gum always saved me every single time because it, it just, it opened up my my sinuses because it was so spicy and everything. It just making me cry in, in class. Like, oh, this, this gum's so good. I can finally smell. <laughs> hello, D10. Hello, Vogan. Hope you're both having a wonderful day. And well, just got back from my trip. How was your trip, Larvae? Uh, I was about to say, where'd you go? But that, that might be a little too personal. Uh, I hope you had a wonderful trip. Welcome home, welcome home. Last streak? Oh, that's okay. Soften's just leaving it at room temperature for a bit. See, that's... That's part of the issue, is that... A lot of my baking and stuff is very spur... Like, uh, in the moment. Like, sporadic. I'm not doing anything, and then I'm just like, you know what? I have nothing to do right now. Why not make some cookies? So I don't really think about it. It's just kind of like, yeah, I'm gonna go do this thing now, <laughs> just out of nowhere. And so leaving it in, leaving it out for a bit before I start, never seems very good to me. It doesn't seem like an option because it feels like if I have to wait, then I'm gonna lose the motivation to do the thing. So I need to do the thing now. But I can't do the thing now because there are things that need to be left in room temperature for a bit to soften, like butter. And then I'm like, well, I could just use the microwave. And then that's how it always, that's how it always ends. <laughs> I just use the microwave. I now have a cabinet butter for making, for making cookies. Wait, you now have a cabinet butter for making cookies. Wait, why? So you have like a stick of butter that is left in the cabinet? Oh? I do other gems to get to that butter before I do. Purple one was my favorite flavor of five. I don't remember the purple one. I remember there was like some mint one and then there was a... That cinnamon, that spicy cinnamon one. Those are the only two I remember. I think there might have also been a citrus one. Yeah, I think those were the only three I remember. Ah, uh, thank you so much for the lurk, my god. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Catching up chat. No worries then, about 10-15 seconds uh, should work. I I try that and then that's not enough. It's still a little too... It, a little too... Um, too dense and then... I feel like I put it in there for just a couple more... A couple more seconds and then it's just fully melted. I'm like... Well, I can't unmelt it now, can I? <laughs> you know? Hello, guys. Welcome in, welcome in. Only twice. Uh, I recently... I recently implemented the counts for the, the daily check-in, so... It does not accurately represent... Uh, how much people have gotten ever since I did the redeem. It's only been able to count it ever since I implemented that counter. So, yes, it's, you've only done it twice ever since I since I implemented it. I know, I know. I, I wish I could have it count those uh, all that other time. But I cannot. I do not have the uh, history 
to get to uh, add all of that to it. Let's see. Doo -doo -doo. I googled it and you seem to have had the original three. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, this was back in like, oh my goodness, uh, 2010s ish. 2010s, give or take. So maybe. So the magical thing about making fluffy cookies is to use room temperature butter. You must never melt it for cookies. You can make thin slices to make it get to room temperature faster. Okay, so the thing with my cookies is that they're usually a bit too dense. They don't spread out enough. I don't know what that is. I don't know if... I feel like I'm using too much flour, even though... I feel like I measure the flour right, but it also seems really hard to measure flour correctly. So I don't know if I'm using too much flour or what, but I would say that's my guess as to why my cookies don't come out right. But I could also be um, messing up the, the butter. <laughs> I know that's definitely something I don't do right. How have we been talking for half an hour, chat? <laughs> I don't understand. Oh no, not the burnt quest though, heck. How have we been talking about about stuff for half an hour chat that's crazy fishing stream today uh hopefully we're gonna be beating the beating the mm, buscaraca boss today i was about to say the uh limsa lamensa boss but no we're not playing final fantasy i don't know why final fantasy is on the mind i don't know why final fantasy is on the mind i just like the name of that that city limsa lamensa uh, but yes, we might we might do some fishing. I I do have a lot of fishing stuff. Uh, it's currently not planned, but all I do have planned is to hopefully beat the the muska muskaraka muskaraka boss. Uh, trust me, melting sugar, melting sugar Rex cookies. Rex cookies exactly the way you describe makes them dense. Oh really? Also get a oh get a scale on your flower. It's about 50 grams per deciliter. I have no idea what that means. Uh, but maybe, maybe I do need to scale. Let's see, let's see. Da, 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 da. Oh, melting butter! Okay, okay, okay. So the, the butter could be doing that. I'll keep that in mind and try it next time. Try uh, not doing it next time. Not doing it next time. Another idea, if you have 5-10 minutes, you can also put it in a measuring cup. You could also put it in a measuring cup upside down onto... A plate. Wait. You can put the butter in a measuring cup upside down onto a plate. Should How does that warm it up faster? I'm so confused. How does that work? What what is the science what is the science behind that? <laughs> I don't understand how that warms it up. Oh god, I put too much time in Final Fantasy 14. I've actually barely played any Final Fantasy 14. Akabu, welcome and welcome and good to see you! Two and a half deciliter per cup for Americans. What is a deciliter? What is a deciliter? But maybe maybe I do need to get a scale. Because I see all of this stuff about like, hey, you need to sift your flour to get a proper measurement and other things it's like, okay, you just get the measuring cup and then you like scoop it against the side so there's no there's no overhang of the flower from the the rim of the measuring cup and I feel like those two things are very different and mm, eh. Clever, thank you so much thank you, thank, thank you so much for the lurk I appreciate it hope you have a wonderful day thank you so much let's see I can send an image? Okay, okay. Desi means 10th. I, uh, I was thinking about playing X2 or 12. I really like Final Fantasy 12. That was, I believe, my first Final Fantasy game was 12. Not the Zodiac Age, the original version. Um, I had a lot of fun. It's very grindy, though. I tried to play it on stream, but it didn't feel like a very good stream game. Maybe we'll get back into it one day. I don't know, but I, I did really enjoy it. I did really enjoy it. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, I wanna... Uh, we played Final Fantasy XII on stream a little bit, and then... I really wanna play Final Fantasy fifteen on stream. I didn't get very far into the game. It's a PS4 game, you know, the one where the guys, they're... 
the four guys, they're uh, taking a road trip. They're having like a bachelor bachelor party. One of them's getting married. Uh, they're driving around in a car a lot. That one? Yeah, I want to play that one on stream one day. I didn't get very far in it. I got the... I, I burned myself out because... Uh, at one point, you get onto a boat and the... There's a prompt before you get onto the boat that says, Hey, you won't be able to come back here for a while. Did you finish everything that you wanted to get done here? And that made me panic and made me want to finish everything there. And so I never left. And then I stressed myself out because I kept uh, trying to find everything to do there before I left and progressed the story. And then I burned myself out. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Also, Zeopos, Eric, sit, welcome in, welcome in. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I'm catching up chat. I can send an image. Oh yeah, of how of how that uh, warming the butter up on the plate works. Um, you can send it in the Discord. Probably the food channel would be good. If I had to guess. I almost got two jobs max level after four months. Oh my goodness. Yeah, when I played 14, I really liked Monk. I really liked Monk. I like punching things. Punching things was nice. I I liked not having any actual responsibility beside doing damage. Being a tank or a healer uh, is too stressful for me. Well, in most cases. <laughs> Unless it's like... I don't know. It just really depends on the game. Hello, Brinley! Welcome in, welcome in! Good to see you too! Ace leaders and dust leaders uh, still, scores, still scores you up. I don't get it. I I don't get it. I use freedom... Freedom measurements. When baking, always measure by weight. Really? So a death leader is a tenth of a liter. Sorry, English was my first language. Your brain doesn't work at times. Oh, English is my first language. And my brain doesn't work at times. <laughs> Let's see. 15 has some good fishing. Oh, does it? Final Fantasy is one of my favorites. That's 15. Okay, good. I, I thought it was 15. Didn't they come out with like 16? Measure everything in sticks of butter. Oh yeah, so this loaf of bread is about three and a half sticks of butter long and like one and a half stick sticks of butter wide and maybe two sticks of butter tall. Does that give you <laughs> the how how we're describing oh my goodness chat. Okay, so my room is like 30 sticks of butter by like 28 sticks of butter. <laughs> there we go, chat. New measurement. Uh, let's see. I didn't know that 15 had uh, good fishing in it. We'll have to... Uh, I'll have to remember that. That's exciting. Milliliter, deciliter, liter, millimeter, decimeter, meter, gram, decigram, hectogram, kilogram. I don't even know what a hectogram is. That's the first I've heard of that one. What's funny is that warning is only until you finish like too many quests in the cutscene and you can go back. Oh, my heart. <sighs> Hurt myself out for no reason. Uh, welcome in, Deacon. Good to see you. Playing DPS is great because it lets you free up the mental space for important things like being rude to the support players. Oh no, I would never be mean to the support players. I barely understand what's going on to, to judge anyone else. <laughs> All I know is that I, I press button and my cute ga cat girl kicks. I push another button and my cute cat girl punches the monster in the face. That's all I know. <laughs> and seeing that happen makes my brain go burn. <laughs> I like punchy class. I like punchy class. Yay, cute cat girl kick. Yup. Yeah, I was uh, I was a cat girl. I was a cat girl. I didn't do a whole lot. I think I stopped at the beginning of Heaven Sword, or was it the end of Heaven Sword? I think it was the beginning of Heaven Sword. Uh, if you want to know how far I got. I did a lot of fishing. A lot of the fishing excursions. Um, I think I was like level 80 or something. Something like that. I don't know. I was more into the... 
I was more into like the dressing up and stuff. I was more into like the dressing up and stuff. Um, all the cosmetics and things like that. I really like doing that. I... One of the other things I actually remember from Final Fantasy, uh, my time in 14 was going to the maid cafes. Uh, there was a maid cafe on uh, my region, not my server. I had to switch servers, but like my region. Uh, I don't think you can switch regions, but you can switch servers in the region, something like that. Um, as long as they were in the same region. And there was a maid cafe that would open like a couple times a week and I'd, I'd always go and I'd spend time with uh, the girls that worked there. It was always a fun time. I mean, I, I had to pay them in gold to hang out with them, but like... I don't know, I, I feel like I had a good time. I had a good time. <laughs> I'd also pay them for like food and stuff, so... And they were always wearing maid outfits, obviously, so, you know... Uh, sticking to my, my ever solid lore of Griffin likes cute girls, you know? <laughs> true to character, very true to character. Let's see, the most support unit, alcohol? Wait, wait. You forgot Centileader. Oh, I see. Centileader. Sometimes measure money in burgers. Honestly, money is most often measured in either gold or bread or milk. Very common. We'll thank you for the mopa again. Reading sticks of butter. What? No, we're measuring with sticks of butter. Welcome in, Sumigaki. Hello, hello. I'm catching up, chat. As a tank player, you must you make me frown. Oh no. Dog darn freedom unit units? Yeah, they don't make sense. But they're there. <laughs> Hello, Griffa. Welcome in as well. Hector equals 100. Oh, hectograms. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like my kind of measurement. Hectograms. Oh, heck. Four players with the MVPs without them, entire game falls. Exactly. Oh, wait. I just lost my place in chat. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm almost caught up, chat. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Ordi, thank you so much for the lurk! Gotta go bake! Have fun baking! Don't forget the sugar! Don't forget the sugar, okay? Quick type for- no, 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 no! I've- I've very rarely been backlogged in chat, so this is, uh... This is- this is interesting. <laughs> but yeah, I- I agree. Support players are the MVPs. No one should yell at them. I know whenever I was a support player, I really didn't like being yelled at. I- I still have, um... I don't know what to call. It. I don't want. I don't want to say PTSD. Um, worries of uh, similar experiences to what I what I had in New World in uh, the dungeon I did, where someone was just calling me like the biggest piece of poop ever uh, when I was trying to kill their dungeon, and, and it wasn't even my fault. They just were meeting the DPS checks, so I I always worry that my uh, about going in as a support player and doing things that are more towards group activities than just like a small small group of people that I know because there's always that chance that I'm just gonna get yelled at a bunch and I don't like that let's see yeah cute cat girl kick yeah I actually play tanker support usually I just like making that joke You'd probably be a cat girl too. Yeah, heck yeah, heck yeah. If you feel like you had a good time, you had a good time. Yup, base lore. Yup, my lore. Griffin likes cute girls. The end. <laughs> what type more? She's catching up. Oh my goodness. To be fair, I have at least level 15 all jobs, but I enjoy tank the most. I could see that. I. Uh, I don't. I feel like I might have tried tank and support in uh, Final Fantasy 14, but I don't know, I guess it just didn't stick with me. I know I, I did a monk and I did another class that was definitely a support or a tank. I don't remember which it was, but uh, I don't know, it just didn't, didn't feel right for me. But then there's other ones like New World where I felt the most at home as a support. But then also in uh, WoW, I... 
in classic WoW, I preferred Hunter, but I didn't mind being heal or tank either. Obviously different characters, because Hunter can't be all three of those things. You don't you can't switch you can't switch jobs like like you can in Final Fantasy, so I, I had to level like a different character for tank and and uh, support and all that. Play tank for one wax match and I still feel eyes on me. Oh my gosh, although it was sur uh it was survival hunter. Oh, hunter, let's go. Oh yeah, I Oh, what was it? I don't think I played survival hunter. I don't think I did. I don't remember the classes. Hello that go, welcome and welcome in, good to see you. Blood elf, red paladin, oh I I don't even I don't think I even know what a blood elf is. I don't think that was in the game when I played it. Oh, so welcome in Tila! Welcome in Oculus! Hope you're both having a good day. Online players can be so mean. They really can. They really can. You really gotta be real careful playing with people you don't know. Because they might just scream and yell at you for their own problems. They, they might scream and yell at you and make you cry because uh, their DPS wasn't big enough. Ridley, it's team games that have the most toxicity. PvP or PvE not really mattering. Free for all games? Everyone chill with each other. Uh, oh. But, uh, I can't get to the rest of it. <laughs> oh, let's see. Put people on a team, suddenly it's never the fault of the angry person? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. That was Serpent Arrow, right? I switched to that, and life was good. Yeah, I definitely don't remember a Serpent Arrow. Go for new bloomer. Uh. And even off to bed. Good night, uh, good night, Wakai. Hope you sleep well. Thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out. Uh, tank, I hear, is the most demanding position. You know the per patterns and how to keep aggro. Yeah, absolutely. Like, it feels like in any game, um, tank is, like, the most demanding and the most needed. Like, if you play a tank or healer, but especially a tank, you will get cues, like, instantly. DPS is everywhere, but if you if you don't ever want to wait, to get into a dungeon, play a tank or a healer. Uh, Twitch I didn't, that was a decade ago though. Healers in the tank won't stop pulling the DPS stand and stuff. Oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tank that does everything right isn't noticed. Oh my goodness, exactly. Exactly. They're just like, wow, congrats on doing your job. But you mess one thing up and everyone's mad at you. Everyone is mad at you. Played Dark Knight and my roommate played healer so we could insta queue. Heck yeah! That, that, that is great. See, that's big brain. Big brain. Ah! Sippy tea. I have some sweet tea. But yeah, chat. Um, online people can be awful. You guys are great. We don't yell at anyone here, right? Right. <laughs> Oh, uh, now introduce dungeon queuing. My friends all beg me to queue with them because I ran support. Oh, understandable, understandable. I just couldn't keep up with the learning curve, so I switched to Hunter PVE. Oh, uh, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. I know uh, a lot of people were were goofing about. Oh, Hunter's easy. Like, okay, I enjoy it. Let me play something I enjoy. <laughs> I'm not here to, to play hard game. I'm here to play fun game. So I had my I had my hunter and I, I had my little my little wing snake that I named Skeddy because he was just a little Skeddy noodle. And I um I just you know I did the quests. Maybe maybe one day we'll play classic WoW on stream. Maybe one day. And then uh I did I did I think. The whole hunter quest by myself. I might have, I might, I might have had Kudo do like one, maybe two of the bosses for me. But I did. I gave all of them a really big try. I know I beat at least two of them on my own. I remember wanting to beat my head with the keyboard every time I lost, and I uh, lost all the consumables that I used for that fight. And it was awful and horrible and disgusting and the hunter quest ne needs to die and uh, you were also in that same uh, in that same vein going broke because 
all of the potions that were helpful for the hunter quest were like a bajillion gold and in no one traded you like an actual hunter unless you had the bow and the quiver from that quest so you, so you were just a second class citizen until you got that quest done but in the same vein you were going broke trying to get the quest done unless you did it perfectly on the first try and it was awful <laughs> horrible i'm sorry <laughs> Sports also really broad archetypes, since it includes buff management, heal management, debuff management, the most support, class of jobs, characters pick two at most. Very true, very true, very true. Light the bunny! No, don't light the bunny! Nice, I had a blue raptor I got from outside Orgrimmar. Oh, heck yeah. I had a few different ones, but the one that I feel like I used the most was Skeddy. Skeddy was my favorite. I really liked um, Quetzalcoatl's. Quetzalcoatl's are really neat so it was nice having my little flying snake around i don't play wow but i can't imagine giving the money is it ethical just to just play a month for nostalgia i don't see why not as long as you have fun that's what matters there's also private servers as well <laughs> but what the heck <laughs> um oh my goodness oh we're almost an hour already all right we're gonna go we're gonna go switch to the game finally, you know, like the actual the actual game. Hopefully we beat this boss. Maybe we'll do some fishing and uh yeah. Hopefully my controller doesn't die today. Uh and the controller dies. No, I mean my controller is asleep right now. I haven't I haven't tested it. I hope it works. We might have to remap the controls again. Cause I never figured out why that was happening. But uh today we won't at least have any scuff. I found out that for some reason my computer doesn't like when my RAM is run at the speed that it is supposed to run. So you know whenever you go look at RAM, it'll say that it's uh, this many gigabytes and it runs at like, for mine it's 3200 speed. But if I go into my task manager, it says that it's only running at... 2133 Yeah, it's only it's like running way slower than it should be but um, But and my computer is fine, but if I Fix it so that the RAM is running at the correct speed of 3200 uh, Things start crashing. That's why my stream was stuff the other day. My room has a cap of 3300, my computer caps an awkward 2933. Yeah, I don't know why that is. I don't know why that is. But at least I figured out why stream was scuffy the other day and resolved that. At least it's not my RAM. At least my physical RAM is fine, as far as I can tell. I don't know why it's doing that. It could be the RAM, but everything points to the RAM being fine. Never played Dark Cloud? It's really good. You should try it. It's an old PlayStation 2 game. I don't know nothing about computers. I just throw on Arc Survival Evolved. See if everything's breathing heavily or not at all. Understandable. Uh, when, what's that setting in the BIOS? The XMT or something? The thing, the things need to be set to. I haven't messed with that before. Though the the XMP profile. Yeah, the XMP profile. That's where you change the speed of the RAM. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, check. I game time. For real this time. <laughs> For real this time. For real this time. Alright, I need to turn my controller back on one second. Alright. Oh wait, we gotta go back here. Oh wait, is that? Is that the exit? Or is, is this the exit? Where's the exit? Where's the actual exit? I feel like over here is the exit. Oh wait, there's also... We missed a treasure on one... Of the thingamajigs. Let's see, it's available on PS4, both Dark Cloud 1 and 2. Ooh. I'm gonna play some Dino Crisis. I've never heard of that. I could have sworn we missed a treasure somewhere by one of these guys. Or we could save again. I'm not seeing it. Maybe we picked it up and I was like, oh, no, there it is. I wasn't crazy. All right. No, I don't want to go there. All right, uh, go to other area. All right, shall we're ready for the boss, right? 
boss time, boss time. One straight up too hard for me, but two is so good. I want to try and find three at a LGS. What is an LGS? I think there needs to be a remake of Dino Crisis 1, like RE2 remake. Oh, local game store. Oh, okay. Duh, silly griffin. You mean Rogue Galaxy? I don't care what people say. That game has nothing to do with Dark Cloud. It's also not that bad. Hope you don't get stuck again. I hope not. <laughs> it was so silly. It, it died at, like, the worst time last time. Um... Yeah, I heard that Rogue Galaxy was supposed to be Dark Cloud 3 and that it was pretty good and I think we're gonna play it after we beat 2. Let's go here. Oh, right. Uh, the sun and moon thing. Okay. Do do do, we need the sun signet. There's pretty awful. Oh, for Dino Crisis. Chai, you need to also start thinking about what else to... What else do I need to play? Dark Cloud Theory was its only thing and they scrapped it for a galaxy, so it's only Dark Cloud 3 in Leftovers. I see, I see. My sister loved the series, but they really killed it for her. Aww. I hate when that happens so much. I used to really love Pokemon games and then it just... They just kept getting worse. And now I, I don't feel the motivation to play Pokemon games anymore. It'd be really cool if we played some of the old ones though, like uh, Soul Silver, Heart Gold. I think those are my favorite. Whoever disturbs my sleep shall be punished by death. Mega Rufy Alpha Sapphire was the last hurrah for Pokemon, I feel. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't play those. I don't know when they came out. Little Galaxy's good, but going into it thinking of Dark Cloud 3 does no injustice. Okay. I will keep that in mind. I'm gonna go lay down. Alright, no gun. Thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you for the lyric. I hope uh, you have a good rest. Thank, thank you. Oh, it's the old guy. Toan, the ancient king's spirit is possessed by the dark genie as well. Can you defeat him? Hello, alright, dog. I'm gonna come and good to see you. Hope you're having a great day. It's great, but not being able to ride on shiny Sharpedo still keeps me up at night. Oh my goodness. What? Alright. It does have an effect. It does have an effect. Just keep spinning. Just keep spinning. But we need to watch our... Uh, watch our durability this time. Neither, game, neither does game reviewers comparing Dark Cloud to The Legend of Zelda. Oh my goodness. True, 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 true. Oh, we might be facing the wrong way. Uh, da, 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 da. No! Oh. Alright, item. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. No, switch character to him. And... Fix his weapon. And then we need to switch back to Ungaga. And no, no, we need to do this. I think I think Chai we literally just need to hold this. The whole time. But not break our weapon this time. Breaking our weapon is bad. Spin to win, exactly. Also, look at my jumbo. Good to see you. I just saw someone streaming today and their stream title was Dark Cloud. Sony's answer to Zelda. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like this game is not anything like related to Zelda at all. I don't even know what I can compare it to. That's like saying Pokemon and Digimon are the same. Darling Nix, thank you so much for the follow. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Hello, hello. Oh, I saw, uh, I saw Harper, our friend Neon Harper, playing my favorite Zelda game the other night. Um... Link to the Past! Yes, yeah, sorry, my brain died for a second. Uh, Link to the Past! I, I can't wait for us to play that. This was a really awful boss match. <laughs> I can't wait for us to, to play Link to the Past. I really like that Zelda game so much, so much. I really love the graphics. There's a few games that I have on my to playlist as well for stream that have similar graphics and similar kinds of uh, similar kinds of 
What are words? They're hard. Uh. Similar style of play. To uh, Link to the Past. I'm very excited. Hello, Nyx. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a, a wonderful day. Uh, if you want a better Sony answer Zelda, look up uh, Al Alondra. Alondra? Clap? I, I don't even think that's clap worthy. We just... I literally just held down a button. I just held down a button. That didn't seem like a very good boss. Is this the boss? Please tell me this is this is a boss. Oh no, wait, this is the ship. Darn. I was hoping that was a fake boss and then there was gonna be an actual boss. Darn. You're, you're too versus so adorable. Ah, oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Yes. Right now I am a uh Oh! Right now I'm food. Very food that the chat tells me uh, they want me to be, and uh, maybe soon I might become a cute girl. Also, I'm not the right color for this. Wah. Wah. There we go. Big. Hello, TRT. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hope you're having a great day. Maybe the ship is a boss. Oh my goodness. You held down the button with style? Yeah, I held- I held down the button with, uh... With resolve. What a beautiful ship. <gasps> he keeps popping up out of nowhere! Those people are all born artists. The ship is a testament to that. Whoa! What's going on? Oh. Oh no! Now that the king's curse has been broken, something's happening to the temple! Toan, get on the moon ship! Oh, okay. That way, oh, okay. This old guy appears everywhere, it's crazy. It was so action-packed the way I used that repair powder? Oh, heck yeah, it was. I just, you know, held down so hard. My thumb was getting so tired. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh! Quick time event! I wasn't ready! I wasn't ready! Could have perfected that, darn. Hmm? Space? Will it go to space? boss fight you wanted? Not really, but I do like the quick time events. I do like the quick time events. What is it? What's going on? I have no idea. Houston, ready for takeoff. What's that? Space! The moon people. Hello, Corvello! Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a wonderful day! Wait, let me scooch a little more into the corner. Here we go. Oh, it's opening the wings! The ship does vaguely remind me of something I've seen in the Zelda game. I will say that. Oh! Okay, that text was on the screen for way too short of time. Uh, here we go. The ocean of stars and beyond. To space! Oh, to yellow drops. Um, yellow drops. Yellow drops? We're getting legendary drops? Oh my goodness. Baby treasure planet? It's flying. You're right. That kid must be on it. Oh, you, you think so? The kid? Yeah. The one with the green hat and those beautiful eyes. There's something special. Okay, okay, there's something special about him. Okay, lady. Um, we gotta watch out for her chat. Oh! Yellow drops off Brad Mountain Dew. Ungaga, Toen, good luck. Aw. We're doing the ET thing! ET phone home! <gasps> 
The rabbit shot! Oh my goodness. The rabbits! I thought they were little shadow people. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, the rabbit shot! Someone give her some water because she's thirsty. Uh, also, yes, if you want to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube or my throne. There are my links in chat, and the rest are on my card. The reveal. That's the most surprising thing. Say, oh, I didn't get to read that. Uh, man. Automatic dialogue. Ha. <sighs> Oh, the moon rabbits! Welcome to Yellow Drop. I've heard the story from Nem of Brambu. These days, we have this neat communication system called Crystalnet. We get information fast. Fortunately, the mayor's not here right now. But rest assured, I, Samba, will serve as your guide in place of the mayor. Moon rabbits? Yeah, please come this way. Mochi? What? What's that? Oh, it's a gate. I was like, whoa, like, light path? But no. What is that lake? Lake of Mountain Dew? Come on, Toon. Give you a tour around the village. Or shall we start? Uh... The easiest place? The nearest place? I don't know. Excuse me. A wide phone? Do you guys not have phones? He has phone chat. Yes, it's me. Oh, Linda? What's up? Uh, our date today? Yikes. Come on, I, I didn't forget. How could I forget that? No, no way. Really? Yeah, sure. Gotcha. I'm leaving right now. Be there in a flash. Mochi, like Japanese folklore, moon rabbits making mochi. I've never heard about that before. Wow, I am so sorry, Toan. I have an emergency. I have to go right away or I'll be in deep. Uh, bye. Burrito, Mochi, Griffin. Hello, Ben. Hello, Nero. Hope you've been having a great day. Is that your Digimon form? They're all in my Digimon form. <laughs> hello, hello! Oh, heck yeah, I look so cool! Look, look at me, chat. Oh my goodness. The leaf kind of feels like bangs. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I feel like one of those anime characters that has like the really big, um... Hair loaf sticking out, you know? Like, uh, that one character from Ding and Rumpa in the first one? The- the biker guy? So cool, one could say it's the return of Arisen, VT. Oh my goodness. Hi, my name is, uh, Mania, collector of rare moon items. I collect- I collect old items. Do you have any for me? Oh. Oh, the can't believe it's Mondo guy. Oh, yeah, 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 him, 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 Mondo. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like Mondo right now. <laughs> Uh, clay doll? Whoa, cool. Where'd you get that clay doll? Ancient figure, figuring clay doll made by ancient people. This model's like totally rare. There's only a couple dozen of them. Can I please have it? Please, um, I guess. All right, yeah. Thank you very much. Are you gonna give me something in return? But... I see... I guess you can't, huh? Oh, I know! I'll give you my treasure in return. Here! Sun. Why did- why did they have the sun? Don't waste your breath telling me to give it back. I'm keeping this. This will be my new treasure. Why do they have the sun? Thank you very much. Uh, why did the moon people have the sun? I don't think those two things, uh, go together. I gotta talk to this person back here as well. Tap. Have we met before? Couldn't have, I guess. Oh, okay. Well, I assume we go this way, chat. Hmm. 
Maybe they got the sun during an eclipse, perhaps. Oh, that's a closed door. Cheek. Okay, so these ones aren't named after food. The ones on the earth were named after food. These seem random named. Ceiling scale? Never heard of it. What is it? Okay, so they're useless. This doesn't go anywhere. Where does this go? Oh. One day the moon covered the sun and it never came back. Yeah, the moon people stole it. Blami. Hi, yellow drops. We've kept a particular tradition for ages. The boss completely disregarded it to build a high-tech factory. Wonder if it was the right thing to do. Do you really have to get rid of... Ah, to get rid of the old to create something new? Have you ever seen the bravery launch? It's a cursed board that makes you want to jump off when you step on it. Not that stupid. I'll never get on it. Just burns right through your pocket. Yep. What's this? No way to climb up. There is a ladder right there. There is a way to climb up. Excuse you. Wait. No, that's for the ladders. Hello? You could just tell me I can't climb up right now, but just telling me there's no way to climb up, that's just a straight lie. There's a ladder right there. Okay, game. I'm getting lied to, chat. You see that? I'm getting- Ooh, what's this? I'm getting gaslit, chat. By the game. What's this? Who is this? Ailey. You're from Blue Terra. What are you doing here? Got nothing better to do? Blue Terra. Is that what they call the Earth? Limbo. You need gunpowder to use the cannon that transports you around the moon sea craters? Sure to be somewhere in each crater. Maybe one of the monsters has it. Uh... Okay, well... Mm, mm, where do I go? Cause I just continue, uh, snooping around. You know, this is such a comfy game, I never hear anything about it. It's such a shame. Yeah, same! I... Never heard of it before. Uh, chat got me to play it. Or, well, Hiro got me to play it. Uh, a few years ago, and then chat got me to play it more recently. And it's a really good game. I wish more people talked about it. Even though it is older. Hi there. Who are you? I'm Jive. I know all about weapons, so listen up. To build up a sun sword, increase its original anti bases evenly. And then all five elemental attributes up to the necessary level. Okay. Something, something, sun sword, something anti bases. I don't know what that means. Okay, this seems like an important room. Good job, chat. Like we've walked around this thing once, but I don't know. We haven't seen the the people yet. The one that we gate that we got the sun from yet. So maybe not. Oh yeah, we haven't been in here yet. Oh, there's one. Oh, Linda. Okay, it's the mayor. No, not the mayor. The date person. Oh, I always get stood up when meeting Samba. He's so rude. Oh, I'm sorry, Linda. I feel so bad for Linda. I feel so bad for Linda. Alright. I assume we have to go in here? Oh, yep. Okay. So what is this? It's very large. This is the factory that our boss is so proud of. What do you think? It's something, isn't it? I'm Ladon. I'm in charge of this factory. Ladon? Ladan? Ladan. I was told about you. Nice to meet you. We're shaking his thumb. <laughs> oh? 
Selma's supposed to be your guide. He's not around. Well then. I will take his place and guide you. So, I hear you need to know about the sealing technique. That's a secret skill from ancient time, used by our ancestors. Maybe our boss knows. Shall we go? Alright, Ladan, take me. Take me to your boss. This is the great factory our boss, leader of the moon people, has created. There's nothing you can't make here. Fortunately, the boss is not here. Along with testing the new model, he sent her to contest. If it's urgent to see him now, go to the Colosseum. Colosseum is straight ahead, past the Moon Sea. However, the Moon Sea has changed recently. Monsters are lurking all over now. Also, the structure of the Moon Sea seems to have become more complicated. I'll walk you to the entrance of the Moon Sea. Alright, new dungeon. This way, please. The dungeon, the dungeon. But we don't have to do anything about the village? Maybe? Beyond the skate is the moon sea. But then, it's quite different from any sea you know. Recently, many monsters started appearing in the moon sea. Stay sharp and be careful. Various recovery and support items are sold in this village. Be fully prepared before you set foot on the moon sea. So long now. Right. You know what, chat? The rabbits, that's why they hop! Okay. I get it now, I get it now. They hop because they're rabbits. I was wondering about that. Alright, I guess we... Do we even need any items right now? Sugar starts streaming to only say hi for it. Oh my goodness. You go lurk in sugar stream? Let's go. Oh, where's the audio? Oh, she has no audio for me. Okay. Guess we'll just get jump scared in a few minutes. Let's see. I have... Uh, I don't want to say a lot of repair powder, but I have some repair powder. And I have a little bit of water. We... Ooh, wait. Uh, da, 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 da. 26 of 40? Wait, what is this? <gasps> oh, the, the, the gem! Am I see, I see. What does the gem do? Alright, there's nothing maxed on here. So it gives attack. Oh, it gives every single attribute and ev oh my goodness this is really good chat this is really good I assume that goes on some sort of weapon though to make the sun sword oh no wait we have the sun sword all right on sword that's how that works, right? Sun, sword. Attack, endurance, magic, uh, all of that. Here we go. Kinda wanna equip that, kinda wanna finish this. Yeah, we'll stick with this. I think we're good chat for now. As long as we can come back later. Goodness. I feel like that would hurt. 
Moon sea. Oh, oh, well, I hope we can come back. I really hope we can come back. I haven't saved in a while. Uh-oh. Okay. Somehow we were able to get back. Okay. Oh. They knew exactly where I land. All right. Number one craters. Okay. Wait, there's Atla here? Why, what do I do with this? What? Oh, okay. Witch Helza. Oh god. Oh, this week, this, this week is so knife, yep. This week is so knife. Paper cutter. Oh, there's someone behind me. Oh, there's someone behind me. Oh, there's someone behind me. This, this knife is very weak. Hey, get back here! I'm gonna at least beat this witch. It didn't even drop anything. Hell pock. I thought that said hell pickle. I hate when my week is so nice. Yep. Do you know why his name is Hellpockle? No, I don't, Steve. Why is his name Hellpockle? Ooh, Steve's a little low on, on uh, durability. Hey, we found a carrot on the moon, chat. What, what do I need to do with Steve again? Oh, that's Max. We need Thunder and Holy. Just Thunder and Holy? We got on him nothing. We don't have anything for him? Okay. Well, we could still... Level him up, I guess. Ooh, water. Nice. We fill... Toen's HP. Yeah, we really need to work on Toen, though. That is a really awful dagger. I don't think we're gonna get anywhere with it, so we're gonna just equip this for now. It, it will at least do more damage than that dagger, even though that dagger is a plus two. Oh my goodness. Whoa! Moon bug. Why does the moon bug have a cannon on its back? Oh, why is it a roly-poly? Oh, oh, we almost lost the sun sword. That was close. I don't know if there are more characters, but which one do you like the most so far? Uh, I like Xiao the most. I think we have one more character. I think we have one more character. Because there's, there's one slot right here. For weapons that doesn't uh, have any yet. I don't know when we're going to get them, but... Yeah, I like Zhao the most, and then... So my favorite Zhao, and then after that, I'm not really sure. Ruby, I guess? And then... Tie between Goro and Toen, and then Ungaga right now. Okay, let's see how much faster this switch dies. Oh, that's a lot faster. It's a lot faster. It's toe and weapon, can't carry anymore. All right. Of course, cute girls first, heck yeah. All right, let's see, go to items, weapon. Gora before Ungaga? Gora just has a really strong weapon and I haven't played Ungaga really. So, I don't know. Sham Another sham shirt, okay. Well, that was a waste. Yeah, it's just because Goro has that really strong, like, one-hit uh, weapon. 
So he just feels a lot better to play now that I don't have to swing a bajillion times and like do a dance around them after every hit. This way. Hopefully we can level this one, this one up without uh, too much issue. I assume we need gunpowder to light these. And we need to drop the gunpowder from an enemy. Okay, that takes some gaga. We're gonna go there next. Let's go this way. Hell pop. I can't believe Steve left me hanging. I don't- I want to know why they're named Hellpockles. Okay, grab this. So one of those is a mimic. Second floor? The chests that they have here are very interesting. Oh, we got a map. And magic crystal. Okay, let's go down really quick. Let's go down first. What? Oh, the beetle. I see. Mm, nope, it's a help up. Okay. Ooh, endurance. We need that. What? Gunpowder! I was right! That little tidbit we heard at the... Yellow drops is correct. We need the gunpowder to get to the next floor. Oh, it's a scrimp. We found a scrimp chat. I know they're called Evies, but we found a scrimp. Yummy scrimp. around here. We need to be careful. Our durability is a little low. Shrimp is a funny word it is. And money, child. That's so much money. Right, come here, bug. You're awful. These, these bugs are really awful. These bugs are so bad. Oh my goodness. They need to be tuned. They need to be retuned. They need to like have tracking missiles or something. They're very weak. Oh, there's a chest over there. Ah, so that's how you can tell which way. I'm, I haven't seen the front of any of these yet. Until now. Only ever the back side of the chest. And of course, this place has back floors. I wonder what that takes. Ooh, yeah, Ungaga needs some... Um, needs some levels on his new staff. Just always face south, do they? I've never noticed. There's a sign. Test your courage. Do you just, like, jump? face the same direction. That's crazy. I've never noticed that. Oh wait, why am I changing characters? Cannon can be used now. Use the cannon! Wrong cannon! <laughs> Explore, yeah. Let's 
hee hee. Feet symbol. Number two crater. Decrease a little. Oh no 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 I don't remember if anyone does, but some of the characters have special animations for adding the cannon. Ooh. We'll have to put all of them in there. The mood bugs eating your durability? It really is. What? Oh! I see. Gunpowder. It blended in with the ground. There's the earth chat. The blue marble. I feel like we went the wrong way. Oh no, this is a dead end. Okay. Oh! How much are they taking from me? Five each hit? Oh my goodness. I hate these guys. Five durability every hit. Oh heck. Oh heck. Oh no. Oh no. More durability, please. All right, we need to get out to win again. Elephant emblem, all right. I'm curious where we use these atlas at because the yellow drops didn't seem to have an issue with their village. So I am intrigued. Parts HGR2. Oh wait, maybe it's the factory. Maybe it's the factory? The factory did look, floor did look pretty empty. You should use the cannon with different characters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, space gun. Oh, I don't like this guy. Oh, we're about to die. We're about to die. Ah! ah. <laughs> All right. No dying, no dying. We gotta be careful because this weapon doesn't have very high durability right now. Nyaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Oh, I swear, I hope I have a revive. I hope I have a revive so bad. Where's the pool? Thank you. That's what I was trying to get to. Where's the enemy? Give me an enemy. Go back to the pool. Oh my goodness. Okay. I think we got it. But uh, says they dropped something right here. No. Where's the drop? Or is, or is it this? Is, is it the chest? I just wondered that yellow was a drop. No, it's a chest, I guess. That witch was behaving there. It was doing something. Alright. Like, well, pausing the game, ah. Okay, revival powder. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Let's get Tone back out. Go drop him in the pool for a minute. Oh, there we go. And... Atla! No Atla left behind. Parts HDR? Okay. No Atla left behind shot. Hee <laughs> hee. Playing with fire here. John. Okay. Yeah, we need to get some of those automatic fixes and put them in our things. I don't think we're using the. I don't think we're using both of those amulets. Fire the cannon! Meow. Floor. I am, however, going to quick save. Griffin, it ain't worth it. Oh, getting so close? Yeah, probably not. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. These guys are strong, child. They're taking a big hit from Steve. Alright, what if... Oh, she's low already. We haven't used Ruby much. Oh, oh wait. Uh, the boys are ready to fight. They're, yeah, they're just standing there. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But this thing, like, yeah. <laughs> Trying to intimidate me. I don't know if we need ice or maybe fire. Oh, definitely ice. Or maybe not. No, not that one. Weapon. Attribute fire. Nope, not fire. Not fire. Not fire at all. That was like half damage. Probably not wind. Oh, he's actually attacking. Oh, he's not in- oh, no, not wind. Alright, so it seems like... Ice is the best for these guys. So we're just gonna grab our ice. Don't have any ice here. Alright. There we go. We do need to level up Ruby. Likely thunder, but you're only one point of thunder? Yeah. Oh, right, Ruby can't touch Atla. I forgot I didn't even try thunder. Finger? Why did we pick up a finger? Parts, AMR. The 
fairy we the fairy ring is only plus one, so it's not that good. Someone lost a finger, I guess so. You're crazy. Usually people come and come like cool. Oh, that's that's big numbers right there. Let's try using thunder. Oh, walked right into it. I didn't even get to see. Thunder is weaker on them. Yeah, I think ice might be the play for this area. You would think it'd be fire. Oh. Oh, actually, now that we have this guy, like, control. So we tested. Oh yeah, Thunder is best on these these guys. Okay, Thunder's best on these guys, but it seems like overall Ice is a good one. It le it's at least average, so we'll keep Ice. Imagine the Dark Genie blows up your town. You use the finger. The Fairy King seals it now and throws it on the moon. Oh my goodness, that'd be awful. Okay. Oh, another chest. I'm surprised we haven't found any mimics on the moon yet, chat. Is that the exit away? Probably. Probably. Does it get stronger the closer- yes, it does get stronger the closest I get. Ooh, flap- wait, flap- flapping fish? Flapping fish? What are you doing here, silly guy? What are you doing here, you silly guy? Oh, child, we got a flapping fish. Oh, right when I said, wow, we haven't seen any mimics. Oh, that's so crazy. That's so crazy. Yeah, who would have thought? Grand's feather, give me, give me ice, give me ice, give me ice. Map, let's go this way. Think you can make it to Queens in time? Nope, not at all. We have to come from the moon. You know, I feel like the fish on this level are kind of broken. They're just kind of all standing there. Can I use it here? Nope. Ah, that's what I could try. I don't know what item goes here. We're just gonna have to throw the fish away. Hello, Zuna. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Hello. Parts HD. Whoa, we got HD parts. Got a TV chat. We got we're getting parts for a big old TV. Oh, oh. Okay, we gotta be careful. We've we've lost two. We've lost all of our toe and weapons to a mimic, so we can't lose this one too, chat. Gotta be careful. You know, for being the sun weapon, why does it have thunder? I thought it'd have the holy. Oh, hey! Our ABS is full. For now, I'm gonna take that off. I'm gonna switch it with this one. Upgrade. How's Dark Cloud? It's going great! Thank you! Man, we haven't gotten to times two in a long time. Endurance. 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 Still needs all of this stuff, probably. Yeah, okay. Hello, Kilo! Welcome in, welcome in! Hope you're having a wonderful day. Also, thank you so much for the other night! Thank you, thank you! I really appreciate- oh, another finger. I really appreciate it, thank you so much. 
Casual good fox stream? Oh heck. Just finished watching the Silent Hill transmission. Oh. Silent Hill 2 looks good. Oh. Are, what, are they making like something new for it? Or... Okay, but be careful we don't... We don't break our weapon on another mimic. Oh, I just had a really uh, bad thought. <laughs> um, I am gonna make my D and D group absolutely hate me. No idea what you're talking about. I'm responsible. For nothing. I did nothing. Okay. Yeah. 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 You did nothing, but I still appreciate it. <laughs> All right, chat. Let's see. It seems like we went through the whole map. So let's go back to the cannon. We've used Ungaga, we've used Zhao, so now let's use Toen. So we make of Silent Hill 2 and legit looks spot on with the OG, but with a new coat of paint and modern gameplay. Oh, that sounds really neat! It sounds like they're doing it a lot of justice. Okay, this time with Toen. So far they all look the same. I think maybe next we'll do uh Ruby? I was about to say Rose. Ruby. Oh hey, speaking of. Speaking of Ruby. Oh. Oh, where is it? Where is it? To level her up anyway. Oh, I didn't mean like that. We don't need to level, level her up this bad. Hey, what's over here? Is there another mimic? No? Okay. Oh, yeah, I heard there was like a state of play or something like that going on. I, I don't know if it already happened or if it's. Something coming soon? Um, is there, has there been any interesting news about that? Oh, hey! Our ring is full. Let's go level this up. Yeah, it was earlier. Oh, is there anything good in it? Let's see. Build up. Fire, ice, thunder, wind, rock, and metal. Hmm. We have a rock. Uh, Monster Hunter Wild trailer and a lot of PS5 exclusives. Well, the PS5 is getting more games? Oh, wow. Crazy. Get a fire in here. I guess let's get a another endurance. Oh my gosh, we're running we're running out of uh, stones, chat. Uh, let's see. Another dev team who's doing the remake. Uh, very hit and miss devs, but from what I've seen, they did a very good job capturing the OG visuals and suspense too. Oh, well, that's good at least. State of play was okay. Some games look good. Monster Hunter Wild looks fun. Remake of Until Dawn. So, is Monster Hunter Wild's uh, DLC or is it like a new Monster Hunter game? So, I haven't heard of Monster Hunter Wilds before. And remake of Until Dawn. I feel like I've heard about this game maybe, but I've never seen it. Explosion of all this poison thorn. Next new game. Oh, what what is it like? Is it like rise? Ooh, destruction. Ooh, destruction ring. Is it like rise or the other other recent Monster Hunter, or is it like different? 
Cause I didn't really like the the more recent Monster Hunters. I'll be honest. I was a big fan of Try Monster Hunter Try. I know, I know, it's probably a bad take, but it's my opinion, chat. You don't come here for my amazing opinion. You, you, uh, <laughs> you guys are usually the one that tells that tells me I'm wrong. <laughs> Uh, there's quite a few people who don't care for World and Rise, really. Uh, I have only ever heard uh, people like rave about them. Also, one second, shall we got another bot? I wish I could see what link they were trying to drop so that way I could just ban it from my list. Block turns and phrases. All right, there we go. Ah, uh, let's see, let's see. Well, it's new and so Monster Hunter. It's desert based. Oh, is that what I've been seeing? Uh, for me, it's too early to say. All you can really say is that you have a mount, and the mount might carry extra equipment you can swap to or something. Oh. It sits more in line with worlds. Oh, there's quite a few people who don't care for World and Rise. Oh, they give it that bets. Some people prefer the st straightforward fighting instead of chasing the monster around the giant map. Yeah, I definitely prefer the straightforward fighting. Like, the zooming around was fun for a little bit, but then after a minute, it was just like, mm. This isn't like the Monster Hunter I liked, like at all. Uh, 50, 40, 65, 65. This one might be good, but I can't tell because, oh wait, 35, 40, 69, 65. Oh yeah, this one seems like it could definitely get stronger. So we might turn our fairy ring into the destruction ring soon. Once we have it leveled up, because we have another fairy ring anyway. But yeah, I really liked Monster Hunter Try. Uh, maybe we'll play that someday. Perhaps, perhaps. I don't know how though. I think it was on the Wii. I, I currently do not have a Wii. I used to have a Wii. Um, I might have to like get my hands on a Wii or a Wiimote or something and figure out how to do that. It's just out of Griffin's scope. Griffin does not know how any of that voodoo is gonna work. When you spend the first few minutes of every mention just getting to the monster, oh yeah, 10 minutes. Just wasted, uh. Trying to get to the monster just for it to fly away to the other side of the map. Yeah, it's always so fun. Oh. Uh, I'm just gonna use a key. Bone slingshot? We already have our slingshot. Oh. Oh, he's trying to kill me, chat. Can we reach him? Oh, we can reach him, chat. Let's go. Oh, right. I need to fix it. We're gonna kill him before we get that over there. I believe this takes fire? Yep, red beam, okay. Ugh. Attribute, fire! Where is it? There we go. Now switch our attribute back to ice. Oh, hello. Hello, Mimic. Oh, but uh, the game gave me an idea that I'm gonna try for D&D. So uh, in my Dungeons and Dragons campaign, my character is a uh, Mimic. Um, and we all joke that she has Pika because 
a large part of my character is eating things, like these mimics are trying to do to me. Um, and it's basically how I get stronger. Uh, I like to hoard items because, you know, mimics are a big fan of treasure. That's usually how they rope people in. Um, and But these mimics in the game, whenever they block, they're really hard. They take a lot of my durability away, right, chat? So, I was thinking, what if my character, my D&D character, uh, started consuming something like titanium? Would my defense somehow go up because I would be able to mimic um, the metal, titanium, or whatever the strongest metal is. I would just start consuming it to try to be able to recreate it. So that way, if I ever need to like have a strong defense in um, like an, in a fight or something, then I could just make my character mimic that metal. Sounds reasonable? Yes, yes it does. It sounds very reasonable compared to some of the things that I, I have going on with my character. My, my character is very luck based. My character is very... Oh, you got that roll? I'm sorry, you have to roll again. You, you're rolling for disadvantage now. Or, oh, you got a nat 1? No, you didn't. You have advantage. Just whenever I want to, really. I don't know my mimic lore, especially for D&D ones. Oh, this is like a homebrew thing. It was just very random. Hey, I want to be a mimic race. Like, a sentient mimic. And whenever we started, I didn't really have like a race of people. It was, I just kind of accidentally became sentient and conscious. Um, but it got, it got, uh, da, 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 da. oh, what's the word? The story was changed, so that way, now, in the current version of the story, there's, there's a, there's a group of mimics out there that, that have gained sentience and are separate from the uh, more animalistic ones that are in dungeons and try to eat people. I feel like we should go back, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, so my character's really crazy. Most of my fights are I want to I want to bite the enemy. We're in uh we're in combat right now and uh this last this last session on Tuesday, because that's when my D and D is, so I don't have stream. Um, this past Tuesday, we started combat, and what's this? No, not oh, my durability. I need water. But yeah, this past Tuesday, we had we started combat. And I asked for a slight alteration in my in one of my attacks because I have no real reason to use it. Like I said, I bite everything, I eat everything. Um, I can I I have like a bite, I have a hold, like a mouth hold. I have a, a chew. I have like my character real. I I'm a bard rogue, but. My character just eats everything. <laughs> My character eats everything. The bard rogue is, is just for show at this point. Um, to help my stats for biting things. It's hilarious. But it's very in character. Um, and one of my attacks is called consume. It's a multi-turn attack. So it takes forever to do. And it's the only thing I can really do. Because it also makes me immobile. So I never use it because there's no reason to. But um, I talked to my GM into uh, adding a feature to it. 
notes that if I could successfully consume an enemy, that I would be able to use their forms. So theoretically, I'd be able to transform into the enemies that I successfully ate. I feel like that's going to be very OP later on. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, what's this? Oh, I need Xiao. Xiao Xiao. Alright, let's get Ruby back out. I keep forgetting her name. Oh! Abs is full again. Got all that. Upgrade. That could be really strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I found something else broken about my character the other day as well. Uh, for D&D. So my... Like I said, I have all these bite-based attacks and there was one called Chew. Where if I was holding them in my mouth, I could chew. And it was a free action. And my DM did not limit to how many times in a turn that I could chew. So, uh, I was just like, okay, I'm gonna use Chew. I'm gonna Chew on my opponent. And so I did 2d10 damage. And then I said, okay, I'm gonna Chew on my opponent again. And then I did 2d10 damage. And I said, okay, I'm gonna Chew on my, on my opponent again. <laughs> and then did another 2d10 damage. And then my DM was like, okay, we're changing this. It's too OP. Um... You can't just keep chewing until they're dead. <laughs> you can't have a bajillion attacks in one turn, I'm sorry. It's like, oh darn. Okay. So from now on, I only get uh, one chew per, per turn. It's crazy. I can't believe I got nerfed like that. Oh, he almost hit me with that shovel. Also, oh my goodness, this floor is awful, chat. I hate that my character keeps getting thirsty. Does your mimic, char mi does your mimic character have hands? Yes, my mi mimic character does have hands. In all uh, aspects, she looks like a normal high school girl. Normally, normally. I also have a... something that I asked for that I haven't really used much. Um, it's a... Uh, I don't even know what to call it. Body alteration, so that way I'm able to move my mouth to wherever I want on my body. So that way, if for some reason I can only use my hands and I can't reach them for any other reason, I can put my hand out and still bite them. <laughs> because my character is so, um, so, because my character only bites. I, I have other attacks, but biting is very, uh, primary in my character's fighting style. So it's very hard to do if, for some reason, my mouth was unable to reach the enemy. Hello, Gorgi! Welcome in, welcome in! I think we're gonna leave at this point, because we've done a whole lot of floors without doing anything. Without, like, saving or anything, and that's making me spooked a little. Hope you're having a wonderful day, Gorgi! So I assume all of this goes into the... Oh, hey. Chest. I assume all of this goes into the factory. Also, yes, if any of 
you want to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube or my throne. There are my links in chat and the rest are on my card. Grass cake. Hello, girlfriend. How you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? Oh, we're almost out of our pear powder. Um, I'm good. Good to hear. I guess that just shows where the where the moon sea is. Hello, Kevin. Welcome in as well. Hope you're having a great day. So we need to find the shaw. I wish I could use my feather here. You walk so slow. Oh, hey. Oh, or not. I guess he doesn't sell weapons. But um, oh, hey. Road of Eden. Let's go. Oh, hey, shop. Okay, we found it. We found it. Do, do, do anything I need to sell. Tannin powder or skate powder. Gun made of shell. Fires, magic, bolts, gun. I feel like that's gonna be for the new character. His name is Snail. Jackal upgraded machine gun. Oh, I think I'm gonna like this character. Don't know. Don't even know their name. Beast Buster. Okay, we're gonna get. Now that we can afford it, we're gonna get a couple of these. We need to get water. We need to get... I feel like we have enough food. Okay. Found the shop. Wait, 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 wait! Wait! They didn't have repair powder, did they? We didn't have repair powder! Where's the repair powder? They did have repair powder, okay. Me being a silly goober. Holy heck, we almost left the most important thing there, Chad. <laughs> almost! Auto repair powder? No, just the regular repair powder. I bought some of the auto stuff and then I forgot to buy the normal one. I'm just dumb like that. Me buys auto repair powder. Wait, did they have repair powder? Oh my god. Lack of brain cells, I swear. Oh, hey, Samba. Oh, Sam Samba's the, the guy. Now, do you have to have... I think you do have to have the auto repair powder in an active slot for it to work, yes. I believe you do. Um... Oh. Darn, we can't put anything in the bank chat. We have to keep holding on to all this bait right here. Alright. No, well, it doesn't look like there's any chests in there. So yeah, we're gonna have to replace one of our amulets for the auto repair powder, but it would be nice to have the auto repair powder in that off chance that I am dumb and break something. Thought I saw something right here, I guess not. My dog was just a butthead and opened my door. Ah. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, this camera position is awful. Okay, what's over here? 
Oh, yes, it has to be your active item. I remember not knowing the first time I bought some. Oh, yeah. I think it says it in the description. Ooh, another fruit of Eden. Hey, you're not from around here, are you? Weirdo. Can't believe that Samba got a girlfriend before me. I'm sorry, Lumba. I'm sorry, Lumba. Salsa? I don't like you. I'm watching you. I don't like salsa. I don't like salsa. Salsa's mean. Salsa called me a weirdo. Okay, let's go in here. I'm gonna go... Um, close my door really quick, because I'm sure you can hear Hiro, so one second shot. Goodness, dogs. Goodness, goodness. I closed the door quickly, like within a minute of getting up, and then I sat down and they reopened the door and then left the room. Oh my goodness. Silly dogs. Silly, silly. Alright, so for this one, I'm curious if there's gonna be any sort of requirements. Like, the previous areas. Alright, so this seems like it takes a crown and something that's leaf-shaped. Can't see anything without this. And I? I don't think I have anything for that one. Are we making Exodia? Okay, so this one is modeled after some large animal, an elephant! And then a tusk. And then a hand. And then this one is a twisty swirl. Twisty swirl? Is it that, maybe? Get the robot cryptid? Oh no. Oh my goodness. Okay, cha I watched uh, Dungeon Meshi tonight, like the... So 22, I think? Oh my goodness, I can't believe it happened. I'm not gonna say anything, but oh my goodness. I can't believe it happened. That's all I'm gonna say about that. You'll have to... If, you, if you've seen it, you, you know what I'm talking about. Little eccentric wears goggles. Okay, so there's a person that operates that one. Hard to fly, light and durable. I assume that's wings. Maybe it's not too big for here? A lot of these are very... Wish I could re- I could see that. No, I don't have that shape either. Ooh, ladder. Another ladder? That's a lot of ladders. We're playing shoots and ladders? Part, uh, arm. Part, hug over, blah, blah. Okay. These are not where they go at all. I'm gonna put that one right here. Part, foot, blah, blah, blah. Seems like a foot. And a lookout's gonna go right in the center. Perfect. Uh, super amazing perfect. Yep. 
wind, okay? Gorg. Undead Buster. Metal, ooh, Metal Breaker. Attack three. Ooh, those two were really good. Another Gorg. Anything else? Not that I'm seeing. Let's go up the ladder shot. All right. Nothing? Really? Okay. Well, chat. That's uh, all we got right there. What is this? What is this? No, no transportation. Okay. Well, let's use our items and then go back to the moon sea. Fruited Eden. Let's put this on Ruby. Oh, or not. Let's put it on Zhao or not. Uh, Cohen, I guess. Gord. Sogoro, Ruby, and Umgaga. Hmm. I might save those for the new character whenever they come. Yeah, I think we'll do that and we'll save and then we'll go back to the moon. Moon sea. Yes, go. Give me a sip of water. This bunny is also streaming? Crazy. So many people streaming! Ugh. Okay. Jim, she's still having trouble? I see that. I thought her computer got fixed. What's wrong? Oh, thank you for the head fat swagger. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We were gonna be smart. Hmm. Not sure it was running perfectly last night. Was it? I saw her stream crash at the beginning last night. I saw her, um, uh, I don't want to say blue screen because that gives you the wrong, wrong idea. Um, Twitch. Twitch disconnect screen. I guess would be the better word for it. It, it just happened to also be blue. And it had a not like this emote in the sun. That kind of blue screen. I think she went over five hours straight, though that, that should account for something. True, 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 true. I wish I could have watched her stream last night. She streamed so late. Griffin got to bed so early. Oh, didn't mean to open that. Ah. Oh, hi. There's furries on the moon, chat. Oh, I'm sorry. You had a really cool fursuit. I think if anyone were to live on the moon chat, it, it would first be the furries. They get so much stuff done. They're, they're so driven. Of course, there's Griffin. The moon people are bunnies after all. Oh my goodness. You're right. You're absolutely right. Okay, let's go 
get these chests. Hopefully they are not mimics. Oh, repair powder. Okay. And no item. Okay. Uh. Okay. Red beam. <sighs> Pumped with energy, let's go. I'm curious if I need to have my icon on the stamina thing. Or not the, the the auto repair powder for it to work, or is it just having it in the? Oh, yeah, I believe you do. Oh, okay, so I can't just have it in my active items. That kind of sucks. Cause I stay on my on my feather all the time. That wore off, so we're gonna switch back to ice. Ouch. Let's clear this area. Why do the fish guys just stand there? It's making it easy for me. There's the map. Bomb? Oh! Oh, how is he still alive? Mammoth tusk, okay. Oh man, let's go to the beginning first really quick. We left two enemies back there and I like clearing every floor. So let's go kill those two really quick. Maybe they'll drop something good. Maybe they'll drop the key to the next floor. Maybe I already have the key to the next floor. I don't know. But uh, we won't know unless we go find out. No survivors, exactly. No survivors. Reference Creed, yep. Okay, that one was useless. At the very least, it's more XP. It was just more XP. Okay. That is a okay. At least the pool over here lets fill up all our water and HP. Sandra Ruby did take some damage. Okay, Griff, I watch a video of someone else play through. No, it does not have to be selected on your active item bar to activate. Okay, good. As long as it's on my active bar. I don't want to have to be selected on it for it to be used. I feel like if it's on the bar, it should be active. Just like how my amulets are. Eagle feather. Eagle! <laughs> like from Scrubs. Eagle! Parts AML. Okay. Okay, so there's an arm left and an arm right. Okay, we have both the arms. Cannon can be used. Now, what character have we not used yet? Um... I feel like we've used all the characters, Chao. We started with Ungaga, we did Zhao, we did Ruby, we did Toan. I guess we just- I feel like we've done Goro, but... It seems like there's no- I, I'm not seeing a special animation for characters in the, in the canon. Or at least I haven't noticed it. Maybe there was. Maybe there was and I just didn't notice it.
Rook is almost leveled up. Oh, what's this? Vulcan? Oh, that's like the Dune. But not Dune. Gro didn't land the cannon, he just sat on the front. It looked like he laid on it. Or laid in it. Get torn back out. It looked like he laid in it. Elephant emblem. Okay, okay. Maybe it's just too subtle and I just don't notice it. Ah, nope. Not that. Go this way. I knew there were moles on the moon. That's why. It, that's why it had uh, holes in it. I knew it, chat. I knew it. Oh, okay. Uh, what? No, we're not really trying to build this thing up, so. Fire, I guess, uh, endurance, uh, uh, I have a lot of ghosts. That might be better. Upgrade! We need one more level chat, and then we can start using the destruction ring. Could actually use our power up powder right now. And, and get it, but no, I think we're gonna save the power-up powder for Steve. Steve has very hefty XP, uh, more. I can't wait until we build up Steve, that's gonna be cool. Claw? I can't wait until we get the new and improved Steve. Check the replay, Stubby Girl was in fact laying down. It, it was really hard to see. Just because he, he's a larger character, for a second, even to me, it looked like his his hands were feet. I was like, oh, okay, never mind. And I had to look at it for a second, and like right before it fired, it like popped in right. Oh, I see it now. I I see he's laying down. Oh, we're still on fire. Oh, I forgot something. Attribute. Nice. Go. Oh no, don't don't you point that cannon at me. No no. Oh nope, there's a Vulcan over here too. Okay. Stop it. Oh, oh. Alright. Grab the Satla. Oh, heck yeah, we're building a mech chat. We are building a mech. First base, and now we're building a mech. Can't believe it. Can't believe you guys talked me in, into playing a mech game. Crazy. What's over here? I know the map is over here. So we haven't gotten it yet. Ladder. Oh! He's too close! Oh, we got both the ladders. We can look at out the... Uh, lookout now. Or look at the top of the lookout now. Being Tom Griffin into anything except laughing at our videos? Mm. Cover's blown. She knows it's a mech game. Can't believe it. I can't believe it. You guys know I, I don't like mech games, mech shows. Not in the mechs! Yeah, here I am enjoying a mech game. Oh, 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 well, I guess we're not, um. I guess we're not switching our, our ring for a little while. I was about to say our wing. Uh, Axel, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Hope you're having a wonderful day. And liking strawberry anything? Mm. Oh, thank you for that, Andre! Grab that. Alright, let me hydrate really quick. Hello! You can make me laugh at your videos, chat. You just need to pick the right ones.
I laugh at the dumb stuff. We gotta understand Griffin humor. Yeah, Griffin humor is very niche and very silly. Okay, ten. Nine. Okay, let's use our repair powder again. Do that. There's a lot more of this map than I thought there would be. Soap! Too bad soap can't get rid of curses. Oh, it's a good thing we didn't leave this place. There's an antler there. Hello, Axel! We're having a great day! Oh! Whoa. Okay, get out. That one again. Ba doop. Twisted horn, and what's over here? One of these is a map. There's the map. What is this? Ah, yes. After we beat the whole map, we get the two things that show us the things on the map. Perfect. Feels like it always happens like that. Now we go all the way back down to the cannon. Can't believe we haven't gotten a key to the back floor for the moon yet. Uh, there it is. Ah. Uh, Controls, what do they mean? Oh, hey, she does have a specific pose. Yeah, Ruby's is different. If we ever have another I laugh, I eat a strawberry event, I might be able to get her to eat one this time. We may, we may. It, I'll be honest, it didn't seem too much like. I'll be honest, okay. Anything that I feel like I try to get your input on chat, it doesn't feel like you're into it. <laughs> it doesn't feel like you're into it, so I, I try to think of things that don't require chat input. And I see all these other streamers doing things like that you laugh, you, you lose and stuff like that, and I'm like, what do I do? I can't do this. You want my input? Uh, I just mean for like, um, events and stuff that I do. Oh. Huh? Yeah, we can't be trusted. See, but I, I, I gave you the power, like... Uh, for some of my last events, I had like, chat writes a tweet. No one wanted to write a tweet. Like, I gave you full access and no one at all wanted to write a tweet and I said oh yeah I can ch you guys can change my profile picture and stuff and no one wanted to do that either and the you laugh you lose uh thing that I did I got a few video submissions but it was mostly by like uh like a couple of people like a lot of videos from from a very few amount of people so I didn't feel like you guys didn't really want to participate that much in that one either. Like, every single chat-related thing where I needed chat's input, it didn't really feel like you guys enjoyed. If that makes any sense. Does that make sense, chat? So I fault that I'm the humor of a 6 year old man. Listen. I can't be trusted. Uh, in fairness, I don't do the social media stuff. That's fair, that's fair. So it's just kind of hard, like, racking my brain, trying to figure out uh, fun things we can do that everyone would enjoy, because it didn't seem like you guys enjoyed that kind of stuff. And that I see that stuff, like, everywhere else. Okay, with a stick. I, th I feel like this is our new character. It's happening. Oh, that's right. During the test flight, the body fell apart. 
less Abbott and Costello. I don't even know what Abbott and Costello is. More Skibbity Toilet. I haven't seen Skibbity Toilet either. The closest thing I know to Skibbity Toilet was I watched my big sister, uh, Furry, streaming the other day, last week, something like that. And she was talking about this video called Skibbity Biden. And she was like, I'm not gonna put the audio on, but I'm gonna show you guys the video. And then within the first minute, it started talking about things and that would get her demonetized and she and she freaked out and was like oh no 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 <laughs> turn it off turn it off i forgot about this part and that's the closest thing to skibbity toilet i've seen like that's the closest i've seen to skibbity toilet i have no idea what that is that's the closest i've gotten to to knowing what it is <laughs> but it's really funny i don't even know what was going on in the video she was like, okay, I'm gonna try on the video. The next thing I know, oh no, no, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I'm gonna get demonetized. This is hilarious. So do you want to be demonetized? I mean, I already feel demonetized. Twitch takes half my income. The former pair were comedians responsible for that who's on first skit and starting the trend of comedic parody horror movies. Abbott and Costello meet Frankenstein. I, I don't understand any of that. Who's on first? I don't know what that is. How about Chippy Chippy Choppa Choppa? Oh, I I know that. That's the cat song, right? The Chippy Chippy Choppa Choppa Doopy Doopy Dabba Dabba uh, Something 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 Boom 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 Yeah, I know that. <laughs> kind of. I forget that last bit. Um, thank you for that, Pats. Darn. Oh, no, I'm wrong. Theory. This is supposed to be perfect. And I thought I saw a part turn into a weird ball? It's just my imagination. Oh. And, oh, and, uh, who are you? Anyway, let's go back. Oh, we found the pilot for the mech! Found the mech pilot. Third base. Third base. That was a cute trend. It was a cute trend. And now they have the, the Pedro dance. Pedro, Pedro, Pedro. And a little Pedro dancing around in a circle. You asked the question? What question did I ask? I asked a lot of questions. I don't know which one that's referring to. <laughs> Seems like from Blue Terra. Why here? Oh. But we're getting a bunny rabbit? Oh my goodness. Genie? Oh, that. I saw it with the big telescope. That's not much evil. The blue terror folks need help if they are troubled by soul of evil. Oh. Oh. He just called us weak, chat. What? Seal it? You must be kidding. Sealing? That's like, extinct. Yikes. No one in Yellow Drop knows how to seal. Probably. It's not when you put something into an urn or something, right? That's impossible. Wait up. I haven't said no yet. I just said the sealing technique was difficult. There's a cooler way than sealing. Just knock it down. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. Count on me. Here's the plan. I'm in the process of making a so-called sun giant. Clubbing's greater than sealing. Oh, we have the schematics now, chat. Oh, I put the head in the arm spot. Okay. It's the state of the art uh, of yellow drop technology. Let's say it's like a super-sized golem to make a long story short. Sun Giant could easily knock out Genie. But then this very Sun Giant ran away and broke into pieces during the test drive. Magic gem we have now is not powerful enough to support the Sun Giant. You need a Pez Sphere to make the Sun Giant perfect. Pez Sphere is one of the most powerful of the magical gems. If we use that, then the Sun Giant will operate at its best. We're gonna big O the Dark Genie. Or well, big O. Big O. Big O heck. Ha. <laughs> Canning and drawing of evil preserver for future generations to deal with? Yeah, that's what they did. Then we broke it. Oh, well, someone else broke it. We didn't break it. Uh, okay, Hug, next time we have a laugh thing, I'm sm submitting one of their skits or two. Oh. Shout out to Big O. I have no idea what that means. It's 
been put up as a prize for a match at the Coliseum. If you could win the match, you can acquire it. Okay, so we got- we have to- we're in our Coliseum era now. Uh, easy to say, but winning a contest takes hard work. That means, let's join forces. Osmond. Griffin doesn't know her mech anime, but she doesn't like it, so it's okay. Um... Oh, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I've never heard of it. I only know of... Gurin Logan, and I didn't watch that. Yeah, Osmond's now joined the ally. O Osmond is now joined the ally. I feel like that doesn't English very well. well ha uh, welcome in, ally! Hope you're having a great day! Welcome in, welcome in, old thing for the hydrate. Thank you so much. Uh, let's check uh, this machine gun. Jackal. Because we have a lot of money. And then... Sell, sell. Leave. Wait. Wait. I didn't buy what I wanted to buy, did I? I don't think so. My money didn't move. Alright. So, buy. We sold the- Okay, we sold the two items. And now we bought the gun. Okay. A husband friend is now your. Well, great. Heck yeah. Now we go to Osmond. We give him the jackal. Perfect. And now we go build the robot. We'll build the robot. Robot! Robot! I hope there's like a... Somewhere I can look at the schematics. I don't even know which which way it's supposed to go. So I can turn this. So I don't know which way is considered the head. There's that thingy on both sides. Maybe the head goes over here, the head goes over here. I am uncertain. I think this is the head though. The head was that shaped, so maybe that's the head? This seems to be an arm, though. The right arm. I have no idea what that is. Uh, lookout tower? I guess goes there. I don't know what that is either. HGR, HG, HG, HGR. Something right. Maybe right shoulder? I don't know why, why it'd be HG, but... Right shoulder, perhaps? Boom. Parts. I think that might be. Huh? Nope. Okay. Uh huh? That seems like it fits. Ports A M L A M L goes right here. Oh, chat. I still have nothing for that one. I don't think we finished A M R. Now let's do A M L. The grippers on that boy. Finish the arms. Should now, yep, that now looks like that. I think we turn it. So it goes like that. 
It's kind of weird that his arms go down almost to his feet. I think that might be wrong, but... We are, in fact, building a, a mech boy. Uh, that is Osman, I think. I don't know. We don't have a character, though. Uh, there's that. There's an urn here and a tortoise shell. Oh, we have all the parts for this. That's the right foot. I'm confused you're on your own, Griff. Me too. I'm also confused. We're building a mech, but I don't know the, the parts. That's all we got. It looks correct. Look at that. See, look. That lines up um, kind of perfectly. Osman, any relation to Donnie or Mary? I don't know who that is. We'll go up here and then we'll check underneath it, see if any of the treasure chests spawned. Don't mind me, old man reference. We're heading out to buy breakfast. All right, Kevin. Have a. A uh, wonderful trip out, uh, be safe, and I hope you're able to find some good breakfast. Magical power plus two, fire jam, yeah get something yummy! Is that really all we have? Is that really all that was there? Man, so little. Oh, wait, there's other treasure around, okay. Fish candy, that's for Zhao. And we'll look around, chat. Okay, can't go behind those. Oh, there's another one. Fluffy donut! Okay. Not seeing anything else, chat. I think that might be it for now. Unless they have any hiding up here. They would be stinkers if they did that. Cause that would be rude. That would be very rude. To hide things up here. Cause it's really hard to see things up here. Okay, so I think... Oh wait, uh... No, both sides have this. I don't know which one's supposed to have that, but I think we're doing pretty good so far. Let's see if we gotta go to the Coliseum, wherever that is. Much, much to this is there any reason to visit the old towns after you move on that is a good question aside from fishing i do not currently think so but i could be wrong i was actually just thinking maybe i missed some chests in the other towns and i should go back and check but aside from that uh not that i know of besides fishing oh we found a gourd Oh, that's right. Okay, so let's go use all of our items really quick. Use the gourds on him. Use the defense items we just picked up. Fish candy on Xiao, so her defense is up. Fluffy donut, I think, is for Toen. Here we go. Leave. Specific shop items if you didn't grab them. Like the owl sword being pretty expensive usually if you come back. Oh yeah, that too. Also, um, the weapon, the weapon, the stuff you add onto the weapon. The little stones that you add onto it, the additions. Uh, these? 
uh, certain shops sell certain ones and I'm in need of like a lot of metal so we're gonna have to go look through the towns to see which ones like sell what that I need so that as well not every shop sells the same stuff Ooh, speaking of metal breaker I needed that like this one sells beast and only beast for some reason for some silly reason Okay. Oh. I'm surprised we can't fish in this lake. I'm sure there's moonfish somewhere around here. Oh, hey, another fruit. Ooh, and another gourd. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, heck yeah, finding all the treasure. I just wish we could use our grand feather right now because it's a lot better going. Yum. Oh, I think I see another one over there. This leads out, so we're gonna or go that way. And then go this way. Go into this building. Anti-goo amulet, all right. Wait, we were just in here. How could I miss that treasure right next to the door? What the heck? I didn't see it the first time. All right, item. Osman. Now he has a proper hydration bar at least. And give him this as well. Alright. Nice. Hopefully some way there's a schematic of how to build this thing. Otherwise, I'm gonna die inside. Let's see, as a non-spoiler, you apparently only get one sunstone in the entire game. There's no secret purpose to it. You can either fuse it or use it as a capstone to help other weapons level. I see. Thank you very much, Jake. I appreciate it. I was curious if the, the sunstone needed anything. Or it was just, it was just uh, like a gem. Cause it's pretty good. I I would assume that it, it needed something. But it seems like it fit really well on the sun sword though. So that's where I will probably put it. Cause it's gonna help with all of that. It's gonna help with all of that, and it's gonna help my attack too. There's a reward for doing a long series of side quests. Yeah, I was kinda like laughing about that side quest. It was like Okay, so you do this odd job, and in return, you get an eraser. And then, uh, in return for this eraser, you get a pencil. In return for this pencil, you get a doll. In return for this doll, you got a wrench. In return for this wrench, you got a broom. In return for this broom, you got a, uh, coin. In return for this coin, you got a uh, 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 sword. In return for this sword, you got a uh, expensive relic. In return for this expensive relic, uh, you got a shiny rock. A big long fetch class. Yeah, it it didn't seem very annoying to do just because it was always there. It's like the Ocarina of Time Big Sword. It's honestly the only real similarity between it and Ocarina of Time. So the game had a ridiculous chain of exchanges to get a special sword. I see, I see. I thought it was fine. It wasn't like out of the way or anything, so I didn't really mind it. But I think we're gonna start wrapping up here, child. Let's go back to our chatting screen. Oh. That was fun, and my controller didn't die today! Let's go! I'm gonna have to... Uh, 
Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Uh, charge it. I don't know why I wanted to say refresh it. Yes, chat. I'm going to refresh my controller. Yes, that is how that works. Yes, exactly. Must refresh my controller. <laughs> um. But yeah, uh, it was fun. I still can't get over. I still chat cannot get over how easy that boss was at the beginning of stream. I can't. I can't get over how like. Awful that boss fight was. How absolutely no brain cell that boss fight was at all. I can't believe it. In fact, that I think Link's Awakening had one of those too. At one point, it gave you dog food. What the heck? Need to refresh my brain. I also need to refresh my brain. Um, literally spend it when right? Yes. I am very upset that that's all I had to do. I'm very upset that's all I had to do. I just... Mm. Ah! <laughs> I have no idea what to say. Just ah! Just very angry. Bring it up to his manager? I will. I will. <laughs> um... I feel like we got a lot done today, though, chat. I feel like we got a lot done today. We started the next... I don't want to say village, because we're building a mech now instead of a village, but... We started the next construction thing. The moon seems like it's interesting. Um, we got our new character. He uses guns. I feel like I'm gonna really like him. He, if I had to guess, he's probably gonna be my second favorite after Zhao. If I had to guess, but we haven't used him yet. We haven't even used him in combat yet, so I have no idea. But he does do the pew pew, so we'll see. Um, aside from that, it is Thursday, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Cause it's Friday. Last day of May tomorrow, Jack. Can't, can you believe it? I can't believe it. Can be both. If your mech is big enough to be a village, it can do double duty. Very true. I mean, it, it apparently does have like a lookout tower. So, you know, maybe. Just the monster flying past, they really are. I blinked and it went from January to June crazy also there's a new steam next fest coming in like the 9th i believe something like that around early june which is crazy because i feel like we just got done with one like a month or two ago so i'm gonna have to pick up some more demos for us to hang out and play together and uh hopefully we do find some that we enjoy because i'm I'm running out of copium. I need more. I need more games. I need my fix. I need. I need my new game fix. Um. I need that shiny new game. <laughs> Cause like, we already beat Duck Detective. What are we doing? But we we do need to beat uh, Baladins. That one's kind of a little complicated. So I, I don't know how I feel about that one. I like that one, but I don't know how I feel about streaming it. Cause there's just so much to keep track of. And then I also have to keep track of stream stuff as well, so I'm not sure. But I did really enjoy playing it. It was a very good game. Um, let's see. I think I'm forgetting something. Uh, Multiverses did just come out, and there's some things that I really hate about it right now. But there's some other things that I, I've been enjoying about it. They did pretty okay. They did pretty okay. Uh, with some stuff, other things they haven't fixed at all. Um... Hopefully it goes well tomorrow. I think we're gonna play that tomorrow because you know Friday stream Friday afternoon stream Hopefully it goes well play some multiverses get some rifts done get some get some stuff done on there uh, Maybe do some PvP in there. I don't know but We did play multiverses like my first ever streamed game chat first ever streamed game was multiverses so uh it it's kind of gone full circle-ish i just had my anniversary <laughs> two year anniversary and here here we are two years later coming back to multiverses so that's gonna be uh gonna be interesting i of course i'm always gonna be a fin main even though they nerfed him a little bit 
but hopefully it goes well. It's it's been going okay. I I'm still really upset. I was playing earlier chat and my character started doing things for the buttons that I was not pressing. I was getting so upset and I I lost so bad that I just closed the game after that. I got I got zero three. They I didn't even get a single knockout on that or ring out on that last one. I was like, okay, yeah, my character is just not behaving. I I quit. And hopefully that doesn't happen tomorrow. I'm um, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Uh, but aside from that, it looks like Sugar's having some issues. Oh, I was not happy about what they did to Velma and Jake. I heard about that! I don't know what they did. I'm gonna say Jake, at least fighting against Jake, he felt the same to me. Fighting against Jake felt the same. I don't know what they changed about him. But I also don't play Jake and I don't look too much into him. But I I feel like they need to nerf Batman and they need to nerf uh, Clown Chick. Harley Quinn, yes. They need to nerf those two. Those are my thoughts on balancing. Because uh, those are the two that I lost to, but it also partially was because the stupid control thing. Um, I'm slightly salty about that still. Some of Jake's attacks have hitboxes now. You can slap his stretchy hands and he'll go flying. Oh, that sounds interesting. That, that actually does make sense a little bit. Now that I think about the rift where I had to fight Finn and Jake, that, that does make sense now. I, I knew something felt a little different, but I, I couldn't really pin what it was. But he did, he did seem like he was doing all the same stuff. At least they have hitboxes now. Uh, it's bad interesting? I guess so, yeah, for, for any uh, Jake player. But, um... I was about to say something. It just, poof. Into the ether. <laughs> um... <sighs> words. Words are hard. Hello, Rusty! Welcome in, welcome in! We're just ending! I hope you're having a good day! Sugar stream having troubles? I see that! I see that. I think we're gonna go raid the bunny. She's doing things. I don't I don't know what bunny's doing, but she's doing things. Oh! Heck. Um Yeah, I don't know what I was gonna say. Uh, uh, uh maybe it'll come to me later. Maybe it'll come to me later. I don't know. But I had a good stream. It was crazy yapping for a whole I guess hour of stream at this point. Like 45 minutes at, at the start and then these past like 10, 15. It's crazy. I, I guess I was in a yapping kind of mood today, chat. Crazy. Never in a yapping kind of mood, but it was fun. I had a lot of fun uh, hanging out and talking with you guys. But let's go raid the bunny, of course. Here are my socials as always. If for some reason you guys aren't already following my Twitter or in the Discord or uh, scrub, sub, scrub, scrub, subscribe to my YouTube, or, uh... I don't even know what to say. Following my throne? <laughs> or any of that? Uh, there are all my links in chat. I did add some new things to my throne. Uh, it's awful for me. Mostly snacks. Uh, if, if you wanna, if you wanna be really nice and get a present for our ever... Our, our ever beloved Sipper Hudo for being amazing tech support and like putting all of the parts that you guys help fund in my computer <laughs> and uh, help him tolerate when I'm like, hey, my computer's breaking. Uh, I do have a, a gift on there for him as well. I think it's my pinned gift. Um, but yeah, I, I thought it was kind of funny. But uh, yes, I. Hudo is amazing. H Hudo is uh, the sole reason why the stream still runs. If it weren't for him, my audio would be crinkly. My stream would run in 160p. Uh, <laughs> it would be awful. <laughs> it would be awful. <laughs> it would be crispy, like like the the beginning. Um, but yes, I hope y'all have a wonderful day. And always have, good to have someone to count on. Yes, 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 always. 
And here is our raid message. Thanks for streaming, thank you all for coming as always. There's our raid message. Let's go see the bunny. Let's go see the bunny. All right, see you guys tomorrow afternoon chat. Friday stream, early stream as uh, always. So see you guys tomorrow afternoon my time. All right, goodbye, goodbye.